i hope by watching this dvd and you being able to use this helping hand training tool that it will open many doors as far as your relationship with your bird and involving more people to help you with your bird you know there's a few things that you know we talk about and i've talked about with teresa and, and one of those things is if we're not a leader we're a follower and, and by giving you this information I'm hoping you will be able to lead your bird down the right path and have a great relationship. I really feel that these birds are just trying to find their place in our home. And if we're not going to train them and we're not going to work with them, they're going to pretty much run the roost. And we see that in the wild. We see these main birds in these groups that are the main birds for a reason. And we don't have to be aggressive, we don't have to be mean to them, we don't have to take food away from them, like a lot of training methods. In the beginning, as we showed you, I feel like if we will work with them, like a prey animal, like the animal they are, we can get a lot accomplished, we can make a great relationship with our bird, then we can go on to do some of the, the neat training things and so forth. You know, it's really sad, in a way, that you know we have these birds in our home and we have to put them in the cage and keep them in the cage in many cases because if those birds get out they could bite our children our wives our husbands our friends you know if we had a dog that was like our bird in many cases we wouldn't be able to keep that dog yet we've pretty much decided that it's okay birds bite they'll hurt you that's just something we accept and it's really sad because it doesn't have to be that way if you use these training techniques and you use your helping hand training tool you don't have to have a bird like that you don't have to lock him up because there's somebody new in the house you lead this bird 